first and foremost, I want to say Brakatea Hoa, Brakatea Oshai, Brakatea Hoa, Brakatea Oshai, Brakatea Hoa, Brakatea Oshai. Yahweh Bashamia Oshai, Bashamia Kakadash. I just want to give double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone Rule Well, who teach us this true, truly spirit of Yahweh Bashamia Oshai. Peace and salutation, the Akiyam Zemaudi, pushing the gospel and sincerity and truth. Daily brother Cora from Trinidad Camp coming to you with another lesson to feed the church of Yahweh Basham Yashai, the so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians, the other the Hebrew Israelites. You know, this lesson I want to do concern these wicked ass pastors. You know, I was just browsing through the internet and come up upon this article here. You know, and the spirit lead me, you know, to do a little lesson. Right, and the Hebrew article say here. You say Brazilian pastor arrested for convincing followers his penis contains holy milk. <laughs> hey, hey, when I see this, hey, I just lie. I don't really want to lie. Hey, this place, this place finish. Right? As scripture say, iniquity shall increase. Right? Hey, pure wickedness. This place had a go. Right? How oh, oh, this man, how oh, these pastors them can say that your penis contains holy milk and this we using to cleanse these women rather than using the scriptures, rather than by the word of your Basham Yoshai that you say in your penis that you let these women give you oral sex and you discharge it in the mouth to let us swallow your sperm to cleanse them. Hey, can't wait for the most high to destroy you all pastors that leading the flocks astray, that causing his people to sin, that causing his people to err by your lies. Right? Because the real the real holy milk is the wood of your basham your shy. Right? That what has cleansed all things. The wood. Right? There is First Peter two verse two. He says, "As newborn babies desire the sincere milk of the word, that he may grow thereby." Right? You all in teaching a you all you all you all followers to grow. You all in teaching them the scriptures. Cause really, church, church, church do edify. They don't, they don't bring out, they don't prophesy, they don't bring out scriptures. They don't speak their own mind. They don't bring out scriptures. Right? <coughs> Jump down the article here. Let's see. Um, Valdisi Sobrino Picanto. This picture here. Very Jake is a Brazilian evangelical pastor who has been arrested for convincing his followers that his penis contains holy milk right you say if you're like me you are in disbelief and totally disgusted by this but let me give you more details on this horrible situation right he said Picanto told his followers that the Holy Spirit would secrete from his penis in the form of sacred milk that his pastors that Salakia this pastor said that his penis was blessed that the Lord had consecrated him with divine milk of the Holy Spirit right now these would like to say they like to say the Lord said right the Lord tell them do this the Lord say that right the scripture saying in Jeremiah 23 verse 31 he said behold I am against the prophets said the Lord Yehovah Basham Yahushai that used their tongues and said he said right so they would like to say the most I say as we say here right that his penis was blessed and that the Lord had consecrated him with divine milk of the Holy Spirit Right? So the most I say, Behold, I am against the prophet, said the Lord, that used their tongue to say, He said. 
right? And they were in these pastors in these churches. I would like to say, the Lord said, the Lord do this, the Lord say that, right? But this is what the Lord saying. He said, Behold, I am against them that prophesy false dreams, said the Lord, and do tell them and cause my people to err by their lies. Right? Because you telling these women, them, you know, the, the only way for them to be cleansed is by oral sex, by you giving them your holy milk because the Lord, you know, bless you and say, this is what to do. Right? He bless you with the holy milk. That is lies. Right? You're causing these women to commit adultery because, hey, the laws are your bash on your side. Thou shalt not commit adultery on thy neighbor's wife. Right? Because these these women them have husbands. Right? And you all committing adultery. But you are these women them going on their knees and giving you oral sex. Right? If you are past, you're supposed to know the laws of your basham, your shy. To know it, these is adultery. Right? He say, and by their lightness, yet I send them not, nor commanded them. So the most I say, I send you all not, nor commanded you all. You all doing these things that it work at your own hands. Right? By your own loss. Right, he said, therefore shall not profit this people at all, said the Lord. Right, so you all being deceived by your pastor. What is this, what is this woman, this one holding she belly? This one like she want to vomit, you know, it's like the, the, the pastor milk bitter, like the pastor eating one set of junk food. He ain't eating enough pineapple. <laughs> These women, they may foolish. Right, these women them foolish. Right. I show hey, these women them husband. I showed you know hey, these some of these women them husband hey, have a little understanding. Right? I show some of these men if cause if these men them right in the in the right mind, they're not gonna hey, let a woman kneel long to kneel long to next man to suck off he rod. That is wickedness. No man the right mind. We not allow the wife to do that. To go into the next man and, and give you a polish. No. And that is why some of these women are so foolish. Right? They doesn't like to listen to the husband. She just like a woman learning silent. If she had asked anything, like she asked her husband at home. Right? These women are quicker to do something to the, for the pastor than f listen to the, to the husband. Right, and me surprised at the things what has been going on in, in these Harlot House. Because a Harlot House, what we, we expect to be happening inside here. Right, adultery, you know, fornication, all these things, all these abominations that's going in a Harlot House. Right, so me surprised at the things what has been going on inside here. That is the place for it. That is the place for it. <coughs> right. There is um, Jeremiah 29 verse 8. He said, For thus said the Lord of hosts, the God of Israel, Let not your prophets and your um, diviners that be in the midst of you deceive you. Right? Let not your prophets nor your diviners that in the midst of you deceive you. They're deceiving you all with lies. Right? Because no way in the scripture say hey, for you to be cleansed, you are a suck off the pastor rather. No. When you're reading Psalms 119, verse 9, he says, Wherewith shall a young man cleanse his ways? By taking heed unto thy word. Right? So there's the only way hey, you'll be cleansed. By taking heed unto the Mosai word, by repenting, turning from wickedness. Right? And the Mosai will. Pardon, as scripture saying, um, Isaiah, Isaiah 55 verse 7. All right, he say, he say, let the wicked forsake his way, and the unrighteous man his thoughts, and let him return unto the Lord Yahweh, and he will have mercy upon him, and to our poor, for he will abundantly pardon. 
So there's our young man go cleanse the ways, there's our person go cleanse the ways by taking heed unto the commandments. Keep my commandments and live. Not by sucking off that the past that dirty cock. Right? Not by sucking off the past that dirty rod. And let him discharge in your mouth. You are not going to be cleansed with that. Right? As the scripture we say, he said, do he wash, wash thee with much soap, his iniquity, mark with him still. So by yeah, you laying hey, these pastors dis discharging you all more by gaining them or else sex, you all iniquity, mark with all you, yeah, because all you committing adultery there, that they're going to cleanse all you. Yeah. We're going to cleanse all you, yeah, the, the word, are you about show me your shy commandments. Right? He said one of Canto followers stated he convinced us that only God could come into our life through our mouths. And that's why he would do what he did. He said often after worship pastor Valisi would take us to where the funds were kept at the back of the church and ask us to have oral sex with him until the Holy Spirit would come through ejaculation a hey, wickedness because scripture saying in john 6 verse 63 he said it is the spirit that quickened the flesh profit nothing the words that i speak unto you they are spirit and they are life so hey, the flesh profit nothing right to come out the holy spirit would come through ejaculation madness right madness right the flesh profit nothing the words the most I speak, they are spirit and they are life. Right? Yeah, what I say? I came not to destroy the laws or the prophet. Right? He didn't came to destroy the father law. To keep my commandments and live. Right? They say the good news to this story is that Valdisi, so Bruno Picanto, is in jail. Yeah, you look for that. Right? By the works of your hands. You look for that. The scripture is saying, um, there's a um, Proverbs 6 verse 32. He said, But whoso commit adultery with a woman lacketh understanding. He that doeth it destroyeth his own soul. So the things were going to happen to you, right? By again, skin up again, make out, you're going to make jail. You look for that by the works of your hands, by the wickedness, by the lies you speak. Right? He said, A wound and dishonor shall he get, and his reproach shall not be wiped away. Everybody go look at it, a wicked man now. Right? Adulterer. Right? And there is these, there is these pastors, you know, in these organizations, in, in, in the Esau system, right? In these churches, the scripture says in Revelation, he said, Come out of her, my people. Right? Come out of her, come out of religion. Come out of these churches, come out of these hallowed house, and turn back to the living God, the God of Israel, the God of our fathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, whose name is Yahweh, and his only begotten son name is Yahweh Shai. Turn back to your true power, right? For he will abundantly pardon, keep his commandments, right? You know, and with that. Hope it was a fine, you know. I want to say all praises and glory unto you. How about Shami or Shai, Basham or Kakadash, and double on us the apostles and elders that great millstone rule well. The teachers is true to the spirit of your Basham or Shai. Peace and salutation to the Akiams and all who push in the gospel. This word in sincerity and truth, you know, they did brother Korah saying, Shalom.